Welcome to Premiere Pro 101, Importing and Managing Footage. My name is Mike Wall, and I'm going to be your guide for this engaging and important course on importing footage into Premiere Pro CS6. We're going to cover all sorts of really important information and try and make it fun and interesting along the way as well, dealing with what formats you can work with, what formats can be used natively, and so forth. And then we'll talk about importing different types of footage, whether you're importing from a tape-based camera or a file-based camera or working with footage that you've already imported onto your hard drive and you just want to bring it into Premiere Pro to, to start editing it, or working with still images and then importing audio files and even batch capturing footage if you've captured it once and you want to recapture it again precisely uh, using taking advantage of tools available in Premiere Pro for that. Then we'll get into organizing and managing your footage and all the cool things you can do here in the project panel. There's a lot of different interesting tools and techniques and things you can do to organize your footage and I'm going to cover all those in good detail so that you can really master that organization because as you may know, organizing your footage is really important. In fact, honestly, it's part of the editing process. If you've got hours and hours and hours of source footage, how will you organize it? How will you arrange it using bins and keywords and all sorts of metadata? All that information is going to be, it really is the first stage of the editing process. You're choosing what shots are important and what pieces of the shots are important. And then you're, you're slowly refining your data set to, to work towards what eventually is going to become your movie as you start editing editing the footage in. So all this is really critically important and we're going to go into all the details of using setting thumbnails, working the different views and customizing the views and skimming your footage and viewing your footage and uh, using labels and, and all these great things and then we'll get into some more uh, cool things that Premiere Pro offers like face detection and uh, using adding metadata and using the interpret footage window to customize how footage is, is viewed by the program. And finally, we'll talk about uh, how to deal with offline media. If you've got footage that you've imported, but then the hard drive is not currently available, you'll still see the file available in Premiere Pro, but you won't be able to work with it. And we'll talk about how to get that footage back and how to control and manage that whole offline online media situation. So it's a, it's a rich, interesting course, a little bit technical, you know, more technical than some of the more editing focused things. But I promise the more apt you are, the more effective you are at organizing and sorting and searching for your footage, the better an editor you're going to be and the better your movies are going to be because you're going to be able to find the very best pieces of your footage to use in your movies instead of having to settle for the first thing you come across. And uh, anyway, with all that, let's jump in and get started. 